ABC News undercover investigation about a destination for American tourists, the Philippines. But what are some tourists looking for? ABC's Alex Marquardt was there as cameras rolled and a big bust went down. We traveled to the picturesque Subic Bay in the western Philippines, a hot spot for sex tourism. The American ambassador recently estimated that 40% of American men here come for sex. To investigate the reports of rampant underage prostitution, red light recording. Producer Alex Waterfield and I go undercover with hidden cameras. We've been told about this man, Arthur Benjamin, a 49 year old Texan who has lived here for 25 years. He's suspected of pimping out underage girls from his bar. Over coffee, he tells us how he met his 16 year old girlfriend. He needed somebody to take care of her. Come here. You know what I want. And how, with the help of his bar manager, Lucy, underage girls have worked in his bar. Hi. One of them is 16-year-old Princess, who has given us permission to show her face. Little did Benjamin know, Filipino and American authorities were planning a raid on his bar. You can see the sign, Crow Bar, that's it. Crow, 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 crow. That's it. Get out, go. Get out, go. Benjamin is stunned. That's when we reveal ourselves to him. We're with ABC News. You told us that you have had underage sex with multiple girls and that underage girls have worked in this bar. I've never had underage girls here and I do not have sex with an underage girl. Then we tell him we have it on hidden camera. Does that change anything of what you just told me? Nope, not at all. Benjamin was arrested. Tonight he's in jail awaiting charges. Activists say the authorities aren't doing nearly enough. But every arrest is a blow against this dark world. Alex Marquardt, ABC News, Subic Bay.